Mr. President has shown since after he was sworn in some decisions he has taken may not necessarily 100% right, may not, but he has shown leadership. And that is what this country has lacked is leadership. You are not here to play to the gallery, to make people to love you. Nobody does that. Are you in the way of the pronouncement of the first afternoon? No right thinking Nigerian. No right thinking. You see, the problem we have with labor, with all due respect, when labor say that's speaking for the masses, who are the masses? For class, who are the masses? First of all, it's a scam. It's a big scam. It's a taking away the resources from the states and, 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 and federal government. For Christ's sake, how can you tell a country, a country to spend trillions of naira in a month that you're subsidizing fuel and it's not available? What are you going to spend? You see, when a country where even those who are the ones responsible or involved in the of it are fighting back, mobilizing so-called labor, mobilizing other people, paying money for them to go for interview on television, on the road. We are suffering. Don't remove first subsidy. These things are state managed. Every Nigerian wants how? I want fuel. It's not Nara. I can go and buy it. I want electricity. It's five Nara. It's available. Not where I want fuel. Even when it is 200 Nara, I can buy. It's not even available. Yet we are paid for subsidy. What kind of system is that? The problem we have...